Hey you guys, what's going on? Pure Gamer here, and welcome back to another video on how to make your very own mod without any programming. Uh, so today, uh, we're going to do a little bit more difficult thing than we did last time. Uh, last time I showed you how to make a block, uh, and then I showed you how to make it so when you mine that block, it drops something. Um, so, what we're going to do today is we're going to do some basic crafting and cooking, uh, making some foods. Uh, so hopefully this turns out pretty good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a hamburger. So first we're gonna go over here and click the plus and we're gonna name it we don't want to create the hamburger yet we're gonna actually create something called ground beef. Name it like that. Then go over to item and so click item and then go ahead and click OK so we need to load in our texture so go item texture uh, import item texture alright just click OK and then I have mine on my desktop inside my YouTube videos folder and right inside make a mod video uh, so we're gonna add ground beef raw so what kind of texture is this it's an item all right there's the ground beef it looks similar to the dye because I just used the dye texture but I changed it up a little bit just so it looks a little bit different so there's our ground beef Click select you can see it's different so there's our ground beef I know it's not the best but it's pretty good all right so it's just normal render leave all this uh, go and click next name in GUI we want it to be ground no wait raw we'll do raw ground beef like that all right and then we'll go in here and we will go to uh, we want it to be in materials stack size it can stack up to 60 and enchantability zero max item usage duration uh, just leave that type of tool it's not a tool item damage count can destroy any block no does item stay in crafting grid yes can be dropped as grass seed zero it can't be dropped as grass seed set that to zero actually don't even worry about that because we won't even check mark that alright so it'll bring us here and uh, we will just do that leave this all alone click next uh, we want to be able to craft it not cook it we want to craft it so we'll click that little icon um, whoops so click this and what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in raw that's rue raw apparently we'll just type in beef okay so grab a beef And it takes a beef. Oh boy. Okay, so it takes beef. So go in there, click beef. Click on the beef, click OK. And it takes Let's see if it'll let me do it. Yes, we need two items takes two items takes a beef and salt we want salt we're gonna make salt in this case okay? so has to have beef and salt and it creates ground beef salted ground beef pretty much okay it just creates yeah we'll say it creates two so then we'll say three just for the heck of it uh, click next and it should have created it so now we have ground beef so you can make ground beef that does absolutely nothing so 
Now, we've got to make a hamburger patty. Yes, you heard me, hamburger patty. So, we'll make, we'll just name this hamburger. We'll just name it hamburger, because we'll make, we're going to make a cheeseburger. So, we'll just name it a hamburger. Um, we could make this a food item if you really wanted to. But I think we'll just leave it as a normal item so it can't be eaten. Uh, yeah, so select as an item, name it hamburger, click OK. Item texture, we're going to go to the same place and we're going to pull up cooked hamburger. Click open. Cooked hamburger is also an item. Here it is, here's our hamburger. I also used dye, I just changed it to look like a hamburger. So hopefully it looks good. I think it looks pretty good, especially for my horrible art skills. Click next. Name and GUI. <coughs> <coughs> we'll just call it a hamburger. Hamburger, like that. And then we will put it in with materials as well. And we can, you can always do whatever you want. You could make it a food and have set it to be a food, but it's okay. Stack size, 64. Um, max item usage duration. Um, so, yeah. Uh, just go through some of these. Do exactly what I'm doing here. Uh, so, set all these. Uh, does item stay in crafting grid? Yes. Yes, it stays in crafting grid. Um, yep, so that should be good there. Go ahead and click next. Uh, don't do anything in here. Not really important. I mean, you can, but it's worthless. Click next again. And uh, we're going to add a cooking recipe. So click on the little cube and type in... Uh, what is it? Is it, it's raw, no, wait, it's, I think it's ground, yeah, ground, ground beef, there it is, alright, click OK on our ground beef, and that should be good, should turn into that, just make one of those, uh, that'll work, um, so click next, and yeah, so, I guess we will start working on our cheeseburger, so, I guess we'll do that. Um, so let's uh, click the plus again. We're going to add something else. And now we'll type in, not hamburger, we're going to want to type in cheese burger. Okay, and this we want it to be a food. And we click OK. And we go into food texture, import item texture, and we go to cheeseburger. I made these just a minute ago, and there is our hamburger. I know it has a white outline. I will fix that later. I just didn't feel like it. I didn't make this, so, you know, it's kind of what happens. <laughs> I'm just using it. Okay, so, uh, name and GUI will be cheese, cheese, Burger, like that. Cheeseburger. Um, it's a food. Stack size. It's not 64. I'm going to set stack size to 16. Um, nutritional value. Hamburger will have a high nutritional value of 15. Is food for dogs. Yes. We can give it to dog has effect of potion should we just say it does it'll be s mining fatigue haste slowness it'll make you fat and slow eat food and then the animation yes we want it to be eat we don't want you to drink a hamburger uh yeah so click next again and now it goes on to the crafting of our cheeseburger all right so how we'll craft the cheeseburger for right now. I mean, we'll make it better in the future, but 
it's not there quite yet. So, we're just going to make it pretty much a hamburger, and that's it. So, we'll type in hamburger, and then go ahead and click OK. We want you down here, buddy. Uh, so, ham burger. Okay. Redo this one. We want this to be bread. And this one to be bread. No, this one. There we go. And that will make us a hamburger. So, yeah. In the future, we'll make it so there's like lettuce and tomato or something like that. So, uh, I'm pretty sure that's pretty much it. So, I guess we will uh, we'll go into Minecraft and we'll test it out in just a second. Uh, so, all of this is uh, good. We'll add like lettuce and tomatoes in the future, but, you know, who cares for right now. Okay, let's, I guess, head into Minecraft. All right, so uh, here we are. We're in Minecraft uh, uh, 1.10.2, uh, newest version of Forge, I believe. I will leave a link in the description for it. Um, so uh, let's go see if our mod loaded. It looks like it did. Yep. So we have mod Pure Gamer MCE. It's kind of cool. So our mods loaded. Uh, we'll go ahead and we'll go into our mod tester world where we don't care what the heck we do to the map. And I guess we'll find out if it worked. So, from what I can see, uh, I placed this in here just a minute ago. And I did notice the hamburger icon I placed. It wasn't 16 by 16. That's the thing. So, if you build an icon, it has to be 16 pixels by 16 pixels. Like, little square pixels. And I made it, like, 50 like by 50. And... It glitched and it did that so I'm gonna have to fix that I'll fix that in uh, like a future video I, I won't even put it in a video I'll just fix that so make sure all of your pictures are 16 by 16 but let's see if everything else works so we'll grab our salt our pickaxe our meat and our bread okay so I uh, will drop down our salt oh I'm in <laughs> wrong game mode Alright, so we'll put our salt down, put you over there, and we'll mine it, and see what happens. So it gave us our four salt, and now we can go into our crafting table, and we'll put our salt in here with our meat. I think it goes the other way. Meat and salt. Apparently it has to be done very specific. There's a setting, I'll have to show you in a future video, how to make it so it doesn't matter. Um, so we just grab the three ground beef we just got, and we will throw it in the furnace for just a second. Should cook it up real quick. We'll just wait for it to cook one of them. Come on, come on. All right, cooked our hamburger patty. Now we'll go inside our crafting table. We'll throw our patty right there. We'll throw our bread there, bread there. And if I loaded the picture right, it would have been a cheeseburger. So now we'll see if it lets us eat it. So, it does, it lets us eat it. But I am slow because I ate a hamburger and it slows you down. But it's kind of helpful, I guess. So it gives you 30 seconds of slowness and that kind of stuff. So. Uh, thanks for watching guys. Uh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I guess I will see you next time.